Jessica, the upper cable car station, 2141. Check phone, read book. Let's check that phone, see if you got any nudes. <laughs> Why does this you happen, You did not dude? just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I'm gonna grab a snowball for sure. We're firing back, son. I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Got him! Oh, oh, look at that! Hey, you know Boom, that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? This guy sucks. Oh, ah, Another edge. Hey! But a dodge it. Oh, snap! Oh. Oh, there's the bird. We saw a totem of that bird. <laughs> right <here>. Hello? Come <laughs> on. Dude, why does it. This hey, is putting me in a good mood right now. Boom, shakalaka. Okay. Oh, you got me. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, dude. We saw the totem of this bird. I want to play this totem. Uh, where are our totems? We saw the totem of this bird right here. No, it wasn't that one. It was this one. Okay, that's the situation we're in right now, but I don't understand what that's supposed to be. Sometimes you doing can't nothing hide is the me, right thing to do. I know all your tricks. I'm not gonna hit the bird. Poor birdie, I'm not gonna get him. I will get Michael though. Whoa! Ow! Right. Dude, this one is getting wrecked. And then what? Oh, oh. No more. Oh, oh yeah. Oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> going down. Oh, <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. Oh! All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Going for the kiss, baby! Oh yeah. Nothing like some, uh... Wow, save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah, it's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Why does this game do this? It makes me feel so like, why can't we just have a, a feel-good game? Why do we have to have a game of killers and cutting people and axes and machetes and stuff? Like, that makes me feel good. We were having a snowball fight, right? Hello again. And how are we feeling? Terrified. In our last session, we established that you have a fear of things that are dead or undead. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Okay. The most anxious. Women worry me or men worry me? Um, I mean, I would, I would say that typically I feel like men are a little bit more aggressive and violent. Let me change the page. Planes scare me or crowds scare me? Neither one, really. Um, 
I mean, I, I guess if anything, like a plane crash, because I'm not, why would I be scared of a crowd? All right, next page. I fear heights or I fear drowning. Mm. Again, not really either. I know I can swim. I would, I would, it would suck more to die from drowning than, than from heights, so I guess we'll go with drowning. Why does this guy have, like, weird killer gloves on? Snakes scare me. More than rats, that's for sure. Guns or knives? I would probably say knives, dude. A gun is like... That puts you out of your misery a little bit quicker. Knives are brutal. Those are disgusting. Mm, cockroaches or snakes? I feel like snakes are a little bit more aggressive here. I'm gonna go with the snake. Can we just keep doing this forever instead of like the scary part? I'd rather, I'd rather do that. Clowns scare me or scarecrows scare me? What the frick? Why do we have to bring it to this point? I'm gonna go... I don't know, dude, that's tough. I think that scarecrow's a little bit creepier than that clown. Hopefully we're picking who we go up against in the future. Crows are scary or gore disgusts me? Gore is pretty gross. Oh. Did that startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. This guy is from, um... Prison Break. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay. So he wants to go quicker. Uh, snakes or spiders? I'm gonna say snakes. Uh, needles or gore? I'm gonna say gore. Ooh, zombies or scarecrows? I like the idea of zombies. I could beat up on some zombies for shell. Wolves or gore? Dogs? It's a wolf. It's not a dog. Gore. <laughs> We're picking gore a lot, and I've got a feeling it's going to get. This is very gore. interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Snakes, scarecrows. An awful. <laughs> the sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid once Shit. again we're out of time. That's reality. Uh, I promise we'll talk again very soon. <laughs> this, is, this does not. I don't like this game. <laughs> I don't like this game, I don't like this guy, I don't trust him, he seems very odd. I guess all therapists are kind of odd, but... Don't you guys think this is a little bit... Oh, come on, she deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. <laughs> No. Oh my god, dude. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Oh, son of a and then she bitch. cheated on him. So I got moved to the back, and next to Josh. That's how we met. Really cheaters. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets Darkness. bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah. Nine yeah, hours until the dawn. Same to me. Josh, Hannah and Beth's brother. Complex, thoughtful, and loving. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. 
You know if you're okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it's so good to see you. What's up with him? Being watched. How does this girl not see him? Yo, yo, yo. You mean you things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Uh, gossip about Matt and Emily or worry? I'm gonna gossip. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um <laughs> Lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. Unsettled or confident? So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, curled up into that does me. sound pretty nice. Why, why? This is forever ruining any future cabin in the woods vacations I would have liked to take. Thanks, game. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? I am never in the history of... Oh, oops, I thought I was the guy in the green. Never in the history of forever ever going to be like able to uh, sleeper hit kind of gal, you know. And I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? <laughs> Absolutely. No. Absolutely. When are you going to take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley, alone at last. Dripping. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Hell yeah, right. we're gonna do it. <sighs> You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. All right, let's keep going this way. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. There's a hatchet right here. Hmm. It's missing. What the fuck? Oh my god. It's got broken glass and it's missing. Damn, I'm getting pretty low on juice here. I just gotta turn off my GPS. I'm finally like outside where I might actually use it. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. I'm, I feel sick to my stomach, dude. This is terrifying. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, shit. <laughs> my projectile vomit everywhere. You guys are just, like, just be <sighs> forewarned. Because this is... Uh, uh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Fuck! Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Damn it, no! Get in here and come with me. A lighter? Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. 
I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray it's on. A it's spray a can. can. It's a flamethrower. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm going to go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Guys, I, I, I don't want to do it by myself. Gonna look around, make sure we're not missing any clues or anything. I don't want to do it by myself. I don't want to do it by myself. I don't want to do it by myself. Please help me. Huh, that's cool. Let's see what this clue is. Family portrait. Portrait of the Washington family. Herring. Hannah is wearing a distinctive locket. Huh? What the fuck? Why did that just close? Upstairs in the bathroom. I'm sweating. We're freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It's like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby. Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Sheba's, <laughs> please make it stop. <laughs> 